Uh, on the left, you can see there's the dashboard, the universal inbox, tasks, and the calendar. But you'll also see the particular user. That's whoever's signed in. Uh, and in there, you can see uh, the details uh, for that particular person, in this case, a uh, practitioner. Also, across the top, you will see clinic-specific settings, such as the business side, including various billing sections, pricing, users, etc. Here you can see patients, where you can, of course, always search for patients using the search bar on the very right-hand side, but if you click on the most recent patients who are going to be listed, you can get into their chart. And this is, again, cloud-based, so if you access any patient across any of your devices, they'll show up next in your most recently viewed patients. Prescriptions, you can view what's currently in inventory, what's recently been dispensed, you can alter some of your favorites, and even see if there are any open prescriptions, maybe. If someone uh, hasn't completed one, it'll show as open. Uh, very important around the holiday season, when we had a large, long break, you could look at the refills going out several days to see what patients might need critical medicines when the office is closed. And billing, so you've got patient-specific companies, and then you can generate reports as well. These financial reports you can share with your accountant or bookkeeper so that running the practice becomes much smoother. Again, you can always see how the program works using the How Does This Page Work icon. And lastly, a very important theme will be the green plus sign in the right-hand corner and the gray gear next to it. Whenever you're in a patient's chart, those will be the links to the most frequently used link, uh, features such as notes, tasks, appointments, that you can see here.